Hey everybody, this is Dale Sellers, the executive director here at 95 Network. I have with me Tony Morgan uh, from uh, Tony Morgan Live and the Unstuck Group. And as a member of the 95 Network, Tony has graciously helped make available for us a, an online course that I'm so excited about. And Tony, if you would take a few minutes and just kind of give us an overview of the course and, and really how it came into being. Yeah, so thanks again, Dale, for the opportunity to connect with you. And uh, thanks for allowing for us to make the course available. I, I certainly hope uh, and I'm praying it's going to impact the ministries of the churches that 95 Network is serving as well. Uh, the course actually comes out of the work that we've done with hundreds of churches throughout the years. And what we've seen is really no matter what size church, including the small churches we've served, there do seem to be some common challenges that churches are facing. And so the course then addresses specifically 12 of the core challenges we find in churches, including topics like uh, what, what does our mission field look like? Who are we trying to reach? Uh, we look at creating compelling worship service experiences within our churches. We cover staffing in churches and some of the structural challenges that we see around boards and governance, which just to be honest, for smaller churches, sometimes that seems to be one of the big barriers for churches ex to experience health. Uh, and then there's actually a bonus lesson that I think particularly for the smaller churches that are a part of 95 Network really is a great lesson because it talks about leading change. And uh, the challenge is if we're going to move from where we are now to where God wants our churches to be in the future, it's going to involve some level of change. And my hope is that you would be encouraged and challenged by the content within that specific lesson uh, to really move forward with strength, with health in your churches and some of the areas that really do need a fresh, fresh insight, and then some courageous change to take place. One of the problems I think small church pastors have when they realize where they are is they're just overwhelmed. Mm -hmm. uh, and they, they, they're, they're not staffed in a large way. Typically, they're fighting or at least pulling along uh, uh, disgruntled board members or whatever. Mm -hmm. And so to take a course that's like we said 12 and even a bonus lesson, uh, it, that sounds overwhelming. So formatically, how have you laid it out to make it to where it's, it, that it's attainable for these guys to pull off? Yeah, I'm glad that you mentioned that, Dale, because they, each of these lessons within the course, they're standalone, meaning okay. for each topic, uh, there's a, some written content with some perspective that we've learned from the churches we've worked with in the past. Uh, but each lesson then is designed for you to engage with your team and in your church that probably is going to include some lay leaders. I hope it does. Uh, for some of the churches, you may even have some staff members working with you uh, in ministry on a day to day basis. I'd encourage you to go through these lessons with that team as well. But th it includes team exercises. It includes discussion guides to engage some critical conversations around each of these uh, opportunities, I'm going to call them, yes. instead of challenges for your churches. It will give you some tools for self-evaluation, and then it'll map out some opportunities for you to make some specific next steps. And I really would encourage you, don't try to rush through these 12 lessons, really 13, Rather, take them one at a time, give, give them each, give each lesson its full attention, and it may take you a full year or more to get through the whole course, um, but uh, do, I want to encourage you, take them one at a time and do encourage them with a team of people from your church. And from a 95 network perspective, we're actually providing, uh, if, if churches want to take advantage of it, coaching uh, to provide a coach that they can that they can uh, get on with who will help walk them through it. And we're going to create uh, a, a kind of a network within the 95 network of other pastors as well that are walking through it. So it's not just having the course, it's, it's the community of others working through it together. Uh, because I think all of us are in this together. <laughs> there's, That's right. we've got to see the church revitalized and it's amazing with the unstuck group and there's other companies like the unstuck group. And then recently, uh, Tom Rayner announced that he was stepping down from, uh, from Lifeway to begin a, an entire revitalized, um, 
ministry. Uh, Johnny Hunt just stepped down or announced he's stepping down from First Baptist Woodstock to help with uh, revitalizing churches. And so we want to help these churches. And, and so if you're watching now, I promise you this course is, it. it what I tell everybody is it's, it's 20 years worth of Tony's experience <laughs> all in one course, which I think is amazing. So uh, I really appreciate you making it available for us and for our, our membership. I uh, hope you guys will take advantage of it today uh, and, and walk through it. And again, don't try to just get through it, but uh, take your time, learn the lessons, take your team through it. And then uh, if you need a coach, we'll, we'll provide that for you as well here at 95 Network. So Tony, thank you so much for making that available and just giving us a little insight into what the course is like.